Welcome to Steph Reacts. I am going to react to Roast this episode 4. But right before I get into the podcast, I would like to share with you a fun, amazing fact. Did you know? Did you know that so Sudan, Sudan has more permits than any country in the world? I did not know that, but um, my thoughts about the pyramids actually, I always wonder, how did the Egyptians build the pyramids, you know? Even today, I don't think scientists could actually tell you how they created it, because the technology they probably had back then and everything. It's a, it's a big story, it's a, a lot of story that goes behind that and everything. Persons claim that persons back then way back then, were way smarter than us because they didn't have all the technology that we have today. But yeah, that'll be for another day, but we'll come for the video, so let's go. Screen there, go ahead. And we are back. Welcome to another episode of Roast This, the funniest podcast on caffeine and any network you didn't see. I'm your host, Brandon Lewis. I'm never alone. I'm always with my squad. I'm always with my family. And today we got a special guest, man. We got a special guest filling in for CP and filling in for some of the other guests that be filling in for other guests because I don't know what the fuck <laughs> I'm saying. I'm just guessing, but nonetheless, man. The wonderful, beautiful, gorgeous, all the way from Brooklyn, New York, Lulu Gonzalez. Lulu. What up, y'all? This, this is interesting. I'm ready. I'm down. Oh, we ain't gonna don't roast me. Just don't hey, roast me. Why, 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 hey, boy. I'm sensitive, man. Why, 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 why? Hey. And last but not least, man, my other co-host, man, my other partner in crime, man, all the way from Atlanta, Georgia, man, from the A-Town. Peace of A-Town down, man, the funniest nigga on the scene. Ronnie John, hello, hello, fellow roasters and roasties. Right, boy. Hey man, good to be back in the building, man. We had a good time last week. Oh, the lotion argument got real intense. It did. It, it did. Really got, it that, got that Jergens. Hey, look, hey, look, check this out, Lulu. What kind of lotion do you prefer, Lulu? Good question. Ooh, Lulu. See, uh -oh. I've, uh, I've Carol, my Carol's butter. daughter. <laughs> nah, I like like a good shea butter, and then who makes a good shea butter combo? Is uh, what's the blue bottle? Nivea. Yeah. Okay. Okay. See, I Nivea. said that. I said Nivea though. You but know. but you gotta ask her if you if you met a guy you would date the dude and he smelled yeah. like what kind of lotion you be use, Brandon? Cher uh, cherry almond. Cherry almond. You. Yo, that's what that's. Face, huh? <laughs> how would how would that date go, Lulu? If you smelled cherry almond on your date. All, all I'm thinking during cherry almond is. What bitch left this at his house <laughs> and now he using it and now that's his favorite scent? Like, nah, nigga. Like, Maybe that's what, why he can't choose that scent. Nah, because it's reminiscent of the old, old, old pussy you had. This he said you got on old work lotion, son. She said you got on that old work lotion, you fast memories. That's what oh. you're doing. No, oh, no. You have experiences. It ain't, it don't, and it's not the feminine cherry though. It's not the feminine cherry. It's the it's the it's the neutral it's the neutral cherry. Is it? Is it's it, two is different. It musk, like neutral cherry and musk. No, like, it's like no. It's just like neutral. It ain't, it ain't like oh, he's like a bitch. It's, it's like oh. He added neutral to it on his bottle. They be neutral. He's like this shit neutral, bro. Wow. <laughs> be Lou fighting for his life right now. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Brandon is yeah. making his bottom neutral. Nah, 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 nah. Hey. Deal with neutral, hey. bro. <laughs> hey, while we at it, hey, look. 
while we at it man make sure you guys share this live with your friends click the star to follow and keep up with all the upcoming shows on the all Dev channel follow us on caffeine lulu you got a caffeine account not anymore not no more you gotta get okay, you we one got we got we'll like, we got one i got one it's lulu gonzalez at caffeine Okay, bet. So follow Lulu at Lulu Gonzalez uh, at Lulu Gonzalez. Follow Ronnie Jordan at Ronnie yeah. Jordan. Follow Lulu myself. Cafe at app. Yes, sir. Bang Lewis. And before we get this show started, man, let's pay a couple more bills. Roast Me Season 5 debuts tomorrow. That's right. So everybody watching right now, man, make sure you get your caffeine accounts. Make sure you tell a friend to tell a friend to tune in tomorrow, March 30th. Live on Caffeine Roast Me Season 5 will be live. That's right. Tomorrow, March 30th is the date. So set your alarms, set your calendars, mark your calendars, get ready for Roast Me Season 5 tomorrow live on Caffeine. Tell them the classroom one more time because they don't they tell them. It's the classroom edition. <laughs> tell them one more time. Ooh, they back. They back. Yeah. So don't be like, hey man, y'all still been do that head up shit, man. That shit cool, but that shit really lame. Like when y'all gonna bring back the classroom? So the classroom is back. There you go. Yeah, the, classroom. the classroom is back. Everybody uh -huh. is here. Everybody's back. And matter yeah. of fact, since we talking about everybody's back, come on now. Bring in our surprise guest. Let's see if all we can get him in. Hey, all the way, all the way from a. Uh, <laughs> All the way, all the way from Houston, Texas, man. My motherfucking dog, man. No, nigga, I'm, here. I'm, 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 I'm from, from Houston, here. but I'm here though. Go ahead, nigga. I'm, I'm, all, I'm in LA, baby. I'm back. I came back to Cali. Look at us in here. Shout Look how they got us living in this goddamn back, one room man. right here, like this. This where all the niggas go that didn't get casted all the way yet. They ain't decided they was gonna put us on. We just in one room, and it's, it's a efficiency. In Hey, 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 <laughs> hey, hold on. Why? Billy, you got studio quality headphones. You you got the real good headphones, Billy. Yeah, can y'all hear me? Yeah, yeah, you got. The... Can we hear you? I, I'm in here. What's up? Hey, B. Lewis, man. I'm glad to see you, man. I miss you. I love you, B. Lewis. I know. Uh, I know through my uh drug binge last year. Uh, we you thought that I wanted to fight you. I didn't. I was going through my divorce, and I just want to let you know I love you and the roast. You, this family you, and the roast me. Uh, everybody, I love Cedric. I love Ti and his uh, brand new comedy he just started. Did Billy just admitted he does drugs? Oh, he did. Really? I didn't know that. I'm proud of him. I had a feeling he was gonna crack a joke when he had took us out to dinner before he got the company. You know, never know what's really gonna happen if we. Didn't I'm not judging, but I know that he just say that he went through a divorce, so that may have triggered that, you know? You don't know what people are going through behind doors. Decide to come together, rappers and comics, and make a pack united. I, I knew something was happening. He was a little too goddamn motivated on the goddamn narration. Lulu in this bitch. I'm divorced, Lulu. We ain't got to hide it no more. <laughs> I'm the realest nigga you ever fucked with since you left the military. I got the military jacket just for you today. Hilarious. I'm glad I cheated on Nettie with you and left. Oh, I should have just left my ass. I, I should have just left. And right now, before, you, we, uh, before, we, before we continue, man, if you're watching this stream right now on YouTube, if you're watching on Facebook, we need you guys to go ahead and jump to Caffeine. So if you're watching this stream right now on YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, we're about to shut the live and we're going directly to Caffeine. So go over to Caffeine right now. Make you an account. It's absolutely free. Sign up. Follow all depth and continue to watch this stream podcast live. Yeah. Got to pay them bills. Yep, there we go. I'm about to go ahead and shut it down right there. Now we're about to shut it down. Mm -hmm. One, two, one. About to shut it down. About to go to caffeine. There we go. We shut it down right there. Oh, hey, you know what I'm saying? That's why we still live in my mind. We can't live in that street, man. How? Billy. Oh, Mark. So this is like a minute. What up, man? I'm about to get on the stream. My laptop. Okay. okay do, man, get on, uh, do that. Back in before we do that. Do that. Do that. Yeah, yeah. Jump on that, boy. 
They show a lot of Billy in the comments. They show a lot of you Billy in the comments. Okay? Billy, man. We missed it. I see comments. I just I went to the YouTube. Why can't we YouTube. can't see the comments? It was on YouTube. It's on the YouTube stream and then the caffeine. On the caffeine stream. They say Lulu fine as hell. Lulu is fine as hell. God damn it. Should have married you. Okay. Should have made something out of herself. They say Billy dressed like Chris Brown. Put my time energy in the Lulu. Hey, jump on that. Jump on that laptop, Billy. Jump on the laptop. Is that Jordan? Is that you? That is me, hey, Billy. Yeah, me, man. I'm still oh, here, man. Zordon. I'm still here, bro. The, the, the Black Ranger has returned. Well, I'm the White Ranger, nigga. <laughs> the White Ranger has returned. I have a question. What's about up? My caffeine account. Can you help me out with that later? Because I don't think I can log hey, in. Hey, somebody on. text yeah. me the link so I can send it to Ashima. Okay, sounds good. We got we got you, Billy. Okay. All right, cool. All right. We're going to jump around Billy, for a little bit. Shout out to Billy Sorrell, man. Billy coming back, man. I miss my dog, man. Billy yeah. back, bro. You know what I'm saying? I love Billy. Uh, Lulu, yeah, we got to get your caffeine account straight, man. You know what I'm saying? You no, should get I, used to, um, I used to stream on caffeine. I used to have like three shows on caffeine. For real? And, yeah, I used to have like three shows on caffeine and I stream. And then when I stopped working with caffeine, something happened with my account. And I can't I can't log back into my account. But I used to use OBS on that. Uh, their OBS. Caffeine's OBS. Yeah, it's, it's a little bit of a different know. OBS. Yeah, for sure. It's different. So I, that's I, why I can't get into my account. Uh, we'll figure it out, Lulu. I can, I can figure it out with you. Yeah, them folks. Hey, oh, so it just, oh, so used to, oh, so used to work with them folks, and then y'all working together. Nah, yeah, I used to be on the main you. joint right next yeah. to Drake and shit. C yeah, C CP in the building. Hold on, CP here. Uh, by the way, them, them um, folks don't fuck with you. Kadeem, can you post the link to caffeine in the group in the uh, group chat? Uh, it's yeah, it's right. Yeah, it's caffeine.tv slash all death. No, because I don't see y'all on the um on the private chat. Hold on, hold on, CP here. Hold on, let's let's check out CP sounder. CP. Oh, look at that. Oh, what up, though? Man? PP, what's happening? What's up? What's up? Hey, I can't hear One thing I just got from this video is that um, caffeine has a OBS. I did not realize that. I have to look into that, to be honest. Here we go. You can't hear us? Oh, yeah, you can't hear us? All right, we got to bring you back, man. When you can hear us, man. Yeah. Bring you back. Pop back in. Pop back in. Yeah, we'll, we'll get him back on a second. Back okay. In, man. Shout out to everybody. Right now, once again, man, if you're watching this stream from anywhere else besides Caffeine, man, make sure you log in to Caffeine. Download it at the App Store. Make an account. It's absolutely free. Follow All Def. Follow at Ronnie Jordan. Follow at Lulu Gonzalez. And follow me, Big Bank Lewis, on Caffeine. And continue to support and watch everything that we put out live on Caffeine. Yep. Yeah. So, um, do you, I mean, we're going to drop into this first topic. I think we're going to wait for Billy and everyone to get we back. Maybe. We're going to wait. We're going to wait. But we, you got this one topic. I feel like y'all can touch on this one topic. This one. Let's, uh, let me see. Yeah. 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 Go ahead. Go ahead. Let's, 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 let's do this one. Let's okay, do this one real quick. Oh, let's, do, let's do this one real quick. Yeah, okay. So, uh, a Brazilian singer revealed she was hospitalized after refusing to fart <laughs> in front of her partner. <laughs> I just thought, Lulu. You being, you being a... Oh, man. I mean, she was holding it up for it for so long. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Hey, uh, you being a woman, how do you feel about this? How, do you fart in front of your partner? Let me go ahead and just get that question out the way now. Let's, I mean, let's... not at first. That takes time and trust. Right, to right, right. To a relationship. You got to run to the bathroom at first, you know, for the first couple of months. Or like wait until you go outside or go outside, but just not like you gonna die over this shit? Hell no. Hell no. Yeah, it happened. What was she eating to get this much gas to uh get her to the hospital? Like she's skinny, so it's it's all bean diet. Like asparagus and shit, mad gassy. Uh, mad soy. It's yeah, I don't, I don't I just I don't know how this happens. People saying Mexican food in the chat, obviously a lot of beans, you know. Somebody said, who is this strong-faced woman in this picture? <laughs> I see the caffeine comments going crazy. <laughs> I mean, let me find her name. I think she. I think we should actually say her name. Give me a so second. She went to the hospital for poop, for not poop. The name was... Uh... Her name is not Putin. <laughs> Hold on. Uh, it goes as P-O-T-A-H. I, I wouldn't know how to pronounce that, but P-O-C-O. Pocoy. Pocoy. But. I'm Put in the chat. I don't, I don't know. I don't know how to pronounce that. But that is her name. 
Nobody or, should ever, nobody should ever have this much gas in them where they got to go to the hospital, bro. Facts. Facts. It got to start hurting a little bit. You just hold it through the hurt. Hold it through the hurt. Oh, oh you're going to mute that one, uh, for, 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 for Lulu. Yeah. And it's like this. I feel like this, man. It's, I feel like this. It's like certain this. type of parts that you can get away with early on. Mm-hmm. You, you better than Lulu? Like nasty ass like that. <laughs> All right. Yeah, yeah, I believe this shit. All right, let's see. Don't believe it. Don't believe it. Don't believe it. Don't believe it. Oh, sorry. I guess Lulu got a few tabs. Lulu, you can close up tabs for me. You get a chance. I guess. Anyway. Uh, so yeah, yeah, there's that, that topic. There's also this other one. Again, I guess we're going to wait for everyone. Oh, someone might be back already. Let's see. CP back. Let's see if we can get him in here. CP. Yeah, CP back in here. What up, though? What up, though? Man, shit just, uh, killed my little, uh, that shit at the stand. Man, okay. dog, these motherfuckers, they don't deserve me, dog. What's going on with y'all? <laughs> hey, I'll, CP, I'll let you know this right now, bro. You, hey, you working your ass off, CP. Like, it's, get, it's getting out of hand, dog. Show love. Here, man. Thank you. Show love. Appreciate y'all, man. I'm, Show I'm, on way, love. I'm on my way back to the room, man. I'm going to hop on the computer. But in the meantime, nigga, we kicking it like this. Where'd Lulu go? I thought Lulu was on here. He was having some, uh, some sexual difficulties. She should be back, okay. though. She should yeah, be back. Coming back. Billy here. So I know about this motherfucker, uh, uh, Miri Coat. Yeah, that, so that, that shit ain't about nothing. That shit trash. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, right on. It, it ain't no cherry blossom, huh? <laughs> 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 Lulu, yeah, you back right there. Yeah, Look up, Lulu. Hey, hey, what's that nigga on Instagram? Hey, who that nigga on Instagram? He be like, that's trash. Hey, your jacket is Bubba trash. Dub. Bubba Dub. Bubba Dub. That's Bubba oh, Dub. Hey. Bubba Dub with his LA Laker rant is really, really funny. Trash. Hey, your uh, phone Russell is trash. Russell Westbrook. Trash. Right on. Where you at, CP? I'm in the Uber. I'm on my way to, uh, to my spot. Hey, let me see that jacket, man. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see it, bro. Let me oh, see man, it. You said it was trash. Yeah, it you is trash. trash. Bro. I just want to see how big trash it is. <laughs> <laughs> that jacket costs as much as a Honda Accord. That's a Honda Accord worth a jacket. Hey, you went to the very first time. That man, man. he's smart. Shit. Hey, that nigga knows something. Hey, man, that, you know they don't make it in my size, so I had to price two of them. So I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna yeah. leave you over. Get you a you. nice tailor. You know what I'm saying? That's all you need. Yeah, Plus, but hey. I, I come on now. What's so up, you, went to the store? you went to the mirror store? No, nah, no. Nah. I caught it at this little uh this little boutique. You know what I'm saying? A little a little, a little spot, a little little drip situation. Oh, so you I mean, hit. you know when hey nigga, when I come to New York, it gets stupid. So you really yeah. got hit then? No, nah, I didn't. You know what I'm saying? They show love. Sometimes, you know, niggas know your name. Show love! Like, shout us out, shout us out, CP. Shout out, 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 shout Follow her. I'm I'm here. You already know what it is. Oh, so what we talk about though? I saw that bitch holding in them farts. I mean that young lady holding in them farts. <laughs> <laughs> hey, about this right? You believe that? You believe that, ZP? I mean, it happened. But how so bad what? was she hospitalized? Was it like she like she was done. Man, she she like too. She Look, like this, but this girl's problem though, like you're not just fine, baby. Like you a singer, you got other stuff that's going on with you. It's okay to let your let your vanity down for a second. Like we gotta teach the young girls they better than just how they look. This bitch can't even fart. Like her breath probably go crazy. <laughs> <laughs> You probably true. don't even know what cotton candy tastes like. It's, you know, cotton candy can't hold no hot breath like that. Cotton candy uh, dissolved, nigga. You know what I'm saying? She can't even hold no cotton candy with I no mean, hot but, ass doo doo mouth. But but how how long does a woman have to wait before she fart in front of y'all until y'all comfortable? I mean, like, how long? Look, look, look. At least fart three, and do come with some consequences. Smashes, at least fart come with consequences. Hey, if you fart, I'm a fart back, bitch. Off top. So now we now so now we putting. Now 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 we putting. Yeah, her poops hurt. Them, her poops hurt. They snap. They snap when they go. They listen. 
You can't never you know front what? on me after the fart. You can't never front on me. Like, who you talking Y'all bonded talk to? together for a special reason. Yeah, now. we bonded, man. That fart bought us about 90 more days of figuring this shit out. <laughs> Ain't no dump for nobody. <laughs> oh, you put that fart bro. on the dotted line. You put that fart on the dotted line. You signed a little <laughs> fart deal. You signed you a little fart agreement. You might accidentally uh, fart your way into a marriage. Mm -hmm. I mean, shit. Hey, if you're smart enough, I mean, smarter than. Look at, look at, look at, look at. Hey, hold up, hold up, hold up. Look at, look at B. Lou. No, her walk by air got to smell sweet. She got to have a cherry blossom feel to her. <laughs> her walk by air needs to be fire to me. Yes, bro. Oh, shit. Oh, no, hey, I, they I, on, I, hey, they in the comments roasting the shit out of me. Niggas, I look like a night school teacher. I've been called Sherman Club twice. It is hilarious over here. This is, I, I ain't gonna <laughs> lie. Yeah, you, you do like a uh, driving instructor for a truck school. <laughs> <laughs> what we gonna do is we gonna go over stop signs today. We gonna go over stopping hey, with the. <laughs> Ronnie always tagging along with the jokes on him. I don't know. I don't know, man. That's your break. Put up in the hey. rest stop right here. Put up in the rest stop. Good. Real good. <laughs> oh, I got the whole I got the whole good. truck driver outfit, nigga. This is Oh man. I don't know why he does that. Why? Uh, it's the whole oh, shit. Nigga. This is the whole shit, nigga. This whole driving instructor shit, nigga. Just reach around over there, pull your horn, pull your horn. There you go. Now reach around all right, all right, all right. This nigga driving like this. <laughs> uh, we're the big rise truck driving school. We do 18 rings. We do U Haws. We do uh, Silverado. Right. Now, I'm gonna bust this backwood while you're driving. Now, I'm going to show you how to roll a backwood at the same time. That's crazy, dog. Oh, I see Billy here. Oh, he was oh, yeah. here. He, he ain't here right now. I'm he trying to right figure out if you're going to come back in. He was in here, though. We had Billy Lou. So we had Billy. That's I'm what's up, dog. Shout out my nigga Billy, man. Yeah, Billy Billow, back, Billow's back. Billow's back. back. That's what's up, man. Oh, man. He gonna be on roast me this season? He will. They, are, they already up there. He already here. Yeah. They ready. They take tomorrow, I think, right? Yeah, they tomorrow? Take tomorrow, huh? Yeah, tomorrow. Ooh, I hope them niggas ready. They, they so lucky I'm out here doing what I gotta do. Because when I get back, <laughs> when I get back. <laughs> Oh, Ooh, and I get dinner. That's how I'm finna pull up. You saying cheers at my spot? <laughs> 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 For real, nigga, I can't wait, nigga. I'm a bully. I want to, you know what I'm saying? Like, I want to have, you know, that's like, that's like, you know, that's like, uh, that's kind of like a form of sparring a little bit, man. Dr. Ontario confirmed. It is amazing. Oh, Ontario confirmed. That's what's up. The more the motherfucking merrier. Oh, Ontario. Oh my goodness. I hope he comes for episode five, which is tonight. At the time of this video, I have reloaded all of the videos pertaining to roast me because I wanted to speak in my videos because I wanted to get monetized in the future. So this is why I re-uploaded this video here. But Episode 5 will be airing tonight, and I will be posting it, so be on the lookout for that episode. When does he go come? He said, uh, I told him, I, I, I'm waiting till you I'm waiting till you get the clearance. Yeah, you, please, you, please, yeah. please, I said, I that's all I hear. You roast, yeah. but can you roast the Ontario? Nigga, didn't I tell you Earth? Didn't I tell you niggas Earth? Yes, sir. He's, he's nigga confirmed, Earth? though. He's is confirmed. He Earth? Well, then, nigga, it is what it is. It is what it is. Hey, hey, look, hey, look. I ain't gonna hold down. CP might be the coldest nigga to do this shit, bro. I didn't see a lot of niggas. Uh, Craig, because Craig, Craig won um, MVP in season three. Then Craig was absent in season four. So I haven't really gauged to really know who's better, but right now, for episode one to four right now, Craig is really well. CP did return in episode three, so 
it's not really fair enough. But right now, Craig is in the lead of MVP right now. So I can't really say who's funnier right now. But Craig and CP is up there along with Brent. Let's do this shit, dog. CP might be the coldest nigga to do this roasting shit. I can't even hold you, bro. I can't even hold you. I'm in you. Uber. I'm in Uber. It's half dark. I, I look like one of them niggas beefing with Batman. Oh, that's right. And when I see the bat. <laughs> oh, when I see the bat. <laughs> Trust me. When I see the bat. A Batman rival. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Hey, man. Like hey, man, they had that. They put that acne Uzi up, man. I had to watch that every day before I come in uh, to, to this writing oh, job. Man, nigga. dog. Shout out my nigga Brody, man. Hey, I seen Brody last night. He was. Hey, Brody, be Brody coming face, back through. Hey, Brody, Brody coming back the, the, the day you come back, I'm, I'm booking Brody. That's what's up. That's Tell him don't try to get no redemption, Carl. Mm -mm. <laughs> you got to live with that one. That's your name now. You are. <laughs> acne Uzi. That's crazy, man. I ain't even, you know, but just the thought, I guess, it is funny. If somebody took a little Uzi and they filled it up with all kind of little acnes, you know what I'm saying, that could go on your back and your face, and they just hit the I corner. need one. I, they didn't even give me one. They got beef with him for whatever reason, and, and they just caught him by himself. And it's like, day after day. <laughs> and they're like, Brody! Like I believe <laughs> Down in the mind, like, uh, 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 uh. <laughs> he got the Cleo scene. Oh man, the nigga remixes is awesome. God and they watching it. it on the news. They're like, this brother has been in danger, in danger. <laughs> people watching the people crying and shit on my road, <laughs> in danger. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> fucking CP. Uh, this doesn't people, stop. Uh, She's Jenny, Jenny Pickett drive by in a Jeep and shit. <laughs> and speaking of it, I got the clip. It's 50 seconds. I, want, I mean, we can just watch it, get this out the way now. We, they, I'm oh, still waiting on the conversation. Yeah, come on. Oh, right. man. Let's just get this hey, clip out the way. Oh, my wife's name. Hey, oh, you, oh. You, you about to hear the whole thing. Let's do it. I don't know, but I might skip this part because of copyright infringement. You know, YouTube is kind of funny with that. So, um, if you see it not shown, I skipped it, okay? Okay, let's get this out the way. G.I. Jane 2, can't wait to see the face. That was, a, that was a nice one, okay. Wait, wait, pause it, Danny, wait, pause it. Danny, wait, pause it. Pause it. Look at Jay's face. Wait, pause it, pause it. I pause it, I pause it. What's up? Hold on, pause it, wait, wait. So, where was the angle? I need the angle because Will was clearly laughing. He looked at Jada's face, dog. She sent the hit like a mob. And she was just like, Here's the thing. Y'all think y'all have to remember. Um, Ronnie's right because Will did laugh. But I think Jada give that look, you know? And he already know what time it is. Remember, like Will, he'll sit there and process something before he goes through with it. So he was laughing, I think, just from like everything else that was happening, and then it hit him like, "Oh shit, nigga, what?" No, I'm gonna tell you from my husband's perspective. Cause I'd have been like, "Give it up for Will Smith and Avatar the Airbender." I mean, uh. <laughs> <laughs> See, the thing about it is, like, it's she not bald because she wanna be bald, right? No, no bitch. The alopecia, yeah. The video says she loved being bald. No, it's because she has to accept that, and but so, it's not my choice. So nigga. if you say that, and then a nigga hits you with it's a not my, joke, that's the thing. it's not my choice. He... I just want to ask one question: Who who wouldn't still smash a a, a bitch if she said alopecia? Because I would. That ain't stop me from smashing. So if it ain't something that's gonna stop me from smashing, I don't even know why first I'm of all, like that. First of all, listen, Billy, park the helicopter and get out and relax for a second. I'm sound, I'm in a helicopter. I sound loud. No, nigga, you look like you in a helicopter right now. Oh no, I'm I'm in this I'm in this goddamn lobby. He talking about with the headphones on. It sound like you in a helicopter. Where you at? Where you at, Lou? Hey, hey, I'm in hey, LA. It, it oh, seems like you're gonna right. be like this, and it's what Billy gonna say. Hey, if you look down, you can see the table. <laughs> <laughs> uh, news chopper three. We got a we got a man with a gun on the way on the one on one freeway. 
Uh, traffic's building up uh, right if around. You look uh, to the left, that's <laughs> where. <laughs> and if you're looking to get on the HOV lane today, drive on the outside shoulder. We got a uh, traffic accident going in. That nigga got them guys. Yeah, you might miss your call. Oh, ain't gonna lie. Hey man, listen, that's some Quincy Jones boy. That's some goddamn nut bush. Hey, hey, you know what these is? These them twenty three hundred checks. Yeah. <laughs> that's that we out. That's that uh the uh, we out of world. Shala. Hey, you, you had it right, Ronnie. Them them we all the world. You can have the the goddamn Shalinge. Children and their mothers. Hey, 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 Come on, let's the music play. On. So was Will wrong or not, y'all? What, what's the, what's the verdict? Let's watch the video. Let's watch the video. Let's just the clip. We almost there. We almost there. Oh, they think it's a bit. Yeah, that's cool. Oh, wow. Ooh, Lord. All right. All right, man. Will Smith just smacked the out of me. In front of the white. It's a bit. I need to run here and get a hat. Wow, dude. Look at Lapita. Look at Lapita. It was a G.I. Jane jump. Oh, man. Bitch, man. Man. I'm going to, okay? Lapita just like wait, this. Wait, wait. I didn't, I, is that, he said that? Yeah, yeah you didn't know that? He Lou, did. Where you been? Lou, Lou, come on, man. That time. I, I didn't catch the tail, no. I didn't catch the tail end part. I never heard that part where he was like, I'm sorry, I'm going to. Of course, yeah. Oh, he's like, I'm going to. I'm going to. I'm oh, not yet. He, he slapped. He he's slapped that hard, bro. He slapped the sides out of Chris Rock. He didn't know what to say hey, after that. He, he he slapped Chris Rock at the documentary. He said somebody in the next documentary about to present. What? Yeah, he didn't hear that. What he said after that? He, oh, he, yeah, he, he said the next the documentary. Guy. He hit the nigga. He hit him so hard, bro. You see his perfect oh. feet. Wait, wait, wait! It wasn't a documentary that was gonna be that. No. All right. You know what? You know what, Bilu? What? That's one. For the day, you got three and you out of there. What? <laughs> what? I hey, didn't know that part. Hey, CP, we're gonna bring you when you get back, bro. We'll bring you when you get back. All right, pull hey, CP so out there. Look, yeah, he smacked Chris Rock back. He smacked Chris Rock all the way back to Scotty. It keeps calling me, man. It just keeps calling me. He smacked them back to Pookie, man. Yeah, I mean, was, here's the thing. You know what I, I learned? Like, Will Smith don't put his hands on other people. I can see that. Will Smith for way gangster. too comfortable. Way too comfortable. Smack the shit out that man. He smacked him like I told. He smacked him like he told him, "Don't, don't say nothing about my wife." If he said, he said like it looked like he told him at another time, bro, keep my wife name out your mouth. Then they went back to uh six years ago when they. Mm, I don't know. I don't know. They, uh, when he was saying something about her back then. I think it's a build up of everything that happened with August and being in the internet for the for the wrong reason. Sorry. And on top of that, the entanglement situation and red table talk or whatever that is, and just being the butt of the joke for, for so long, I think that build up and cost him to retaliate. So, when's the last time he hosted? So. Hey, Ronnie, Ronnie, when he was getting dressed at the awards, though, and he was like, he was getting dressed at the crib, he put the jacket on, he was like, baby, you be putting a wig on tonight? No, I ain't putting no wig on. Oh, for real? All right. <laughs> he made no, it shit. was all good until Jada didn't laugh. Watch it again. It's all good. We'll laugh until you bring look at Jada. Yeah, Jada I'll, I'll bring it back. Look I'll at bring Jada's back. face. Look at oh. Jada's face. She was oh. not she happy. Didn't from jump. She didn't laugh from the moment she, was, he stepped on the stage. She wasn't. He, he, he had the, he had the jokes last time about will uh boycott the her boycott the Oscars. Mm. She said, "This nigga, look, look at the face. The wife, look. Oh yeah, I did see the eye roll." And she look at this. She she's like protect me. Mm. Yeah, she wasn't feeling it. She was not feeling that drunk, bro. She's she been saying for a year she don't feel protected and shit. This is a build up. He just slapped August Alcina in the face, really. He, he, he slapped the whole internet well, in the face, man. Saying, he pause, slapped the pause, internet. Hold on, pause real quick. Pause this real quick. Pause. It's pause. It's pause. So look. why does everybody keep saying he not gonna slap August Alcina when if y'all clearly got the whole story, he was done with Jada. That's why she went to August. So if I'm done with my if I'm done with my old lady, I don't give a fuck who dicking her now. Well, he apparently cares about who's making jokes about her. So 
No, like I said, we back now, though. We back now, so I can't trip that the little nigga fucked my girl when I wasn't with her. I can't trip on that nigga because I wasn't, I didn't want her. But now that we back, so I, I think it's mostly because one, it's she not bald by a choice. She got a little disease. She got alopecia, it, yeah. So it's not like she's doing this on purpose. Like she out here in these streets just shaving her head. She ain't got no choice. And no, she's like, I don't wear no goddamn wig. It's hot as hell out here. I'm gonna just, I, I'm gonna do what I gotta do. And two, on top of that, he's like, I already told this motherfucker, don't talk about my wife, don't talk about my family. And then, nigga, this is the biggest night of my career, and you over here talking about my woman, and now she mad, so I'm fucked up night, and I got slapped. You. How much now, money you got to have to be like, I'm do it. yeah, I'm going to do it in front of all the white people. I'm going to do it tonight. Man. You gotta have he knew the risk. He knew the risk. Yeah, he have, did. He knew you it. got jiggy with it. You hey, I think he, he was right and wrong at the same time. Got he that, was. You should have did that shit at the after He was party. right and wrong. What real nigga do? Do that shit at the after party. No, Jaden looked at him like... Now. Ain't going to be no after party. <laughs> Jaden looked at him We're going home after this. You don't slap him. Jaden gave him that look like, nigga, you hear your boy? This your man's again? Your boy, I mean, you know, your boy Chris, he and she and she, and she probably was upset from the last. She was like, "Oh, he hosted again." You know they talked about it before that shit, though. But he wasn't hosting; he was just a presenter. Well, oh, whatever. He's gonna hosting? be there. He was present. Yeah, that's what fucked up. Really? He, got, he got slapped on the wall on the guest wait, spot. Wait, wait, I'm lost. <laughs> he got oh, slapped on the guest spot, my nigga. Damn. So Chris Rock wasn't hosting, my nigga. Both of them. Yeah. Yeah, that's I, crazy. I, mean, I, looked at it, I looked at the I looked at the slap and I was like, two things. Will Smith just wanted to have his moment. And if you look back at the after party, you see Will and Jada la- laughing and happy. Oh, nigga, they did it. They he did it after that. Had that. Had he not slapped Chris Rock, it would have been a fucked up night. Let me tell you something. Long they, night. Billy, they had sex in Chris Rock dressing room after that shit. But they went, <laughs> they <laughs> fucked hard after that, nigga. They had it. That nigga, uh, Vince Vince Bryant said they renewed their vows, nigga. Hey man. <laughs> Like, let, listen, bro. I mean, you know, I, you know, what I feel sorry for. I feel sorry for all the other rock brothers. You know what I'm saying? Because it's gonna be like open season on smacking the dog shit out of them. Jordan and Tony. Not really. Shit. Okay, shit. okay. Let's reel it in. Okay. What if they pull up? What okay. if they pull up? Real quick, real quick, real quick. Let's reel it in. Let's get some clarity. Let's get some clarity. So starting with Ronnie, we're gonna get clarity on this. Ronnie, tell us your standpoints on the Chris Rock and Will. Who do you, who do you got, Chris or Will? Uh am. am you want to go with Chris, but it's like, I'm sure he does. When niggas habitually line step, it's sometimes some shit got to get done. It might not be right, but goddamn it, as a husband, and he got to live with her for the next five years, and she been dropping Tupac letters and shit all year. <laughs> that shit been building up, man. I think somebody might have played goddamn All Eyes on Me before the show, and he just snapped out, bro. So I'm rolling with Will. Fuck that. Okay, Sorry. Okay, bet. Right, husband so, shit. Uh, so, CP, who you got? Chris or Will? CP, in this CP what you got, bro? Like, who, right? No, just give me your stance. Who's your stance? It's not about who right. What's your stance on it? I think, um, I think Chris Rock missed an opportunity to be a true comic and make that shit hilarious in the moment. Like mm-hmm. I feel like, yeah. I mean, I mean, he had the opportunity to bring up August Alcina. He had the opportunity to just roast them all. But he didn't. He took the high road, though. First of all, we see wasn't nobody going to rush the stage to help Chris at all. So, you know, it's like, nigga, something about what Chris should have did. It's like, nigga, why didn't nobody check Will on TV? Come on, man, don't do that. Keep my wife's name. That nigga, that was, that was a light roast. Nigga, you lucky Chris Powell wasn't hosting that bitch. I'm going to tell you what. <laughs> you got to <laughs> and suck their head like a peanut. You know what I'm saying? Like, like nigga. <laughs> Like, nigga, that nigga showed you love. Also, nigga, let's not forget. Real talk, when you at an event like that, bro, you ever see them scenarios where getting roasted is kind of like a shout out? Yeah. Like, yeah, it is. Like, yeah, it, it is. all is. It all is. Anybody, anybody high school have like a mock election or like some little shit where it's like, even if you got nominated for the bad shit, at least it was popular enough to be in the talk for that. And that's kind of how it felt. So it was kind of like, man, you know, he felt like he gave her a little zinger. I feel like if Chris Rock had a wife, she probably would have been like, hey, don't say shit about Jada. You know what I'm saying? You know, like when you got a wife, you be knowing all the girl shit. You be knowing you know, all the girl shit. Yep. Yeah, she do. So, you know, it's like uh, uh, Chris Rock not wrong. He 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 threw her a slight roast. Will Smith could have got up there and grabbed a mic and said some shit that would have had the same impact. Yo, you know, my wife is struggling. 
Chris. Chris, that's a piece of. Uh, you know what I'm saying? You know, it'd be nice, Chris. Hey, I'll fuck you up. Shit like that. That would have worked too. Mm. That would have worked. Had the same, you know what I'm saying? But no, he gave that nigga a, a fucking Yosemite Sam slap and turned around like a goddamn funeral director in that eight piece suit and walked down his out. Oh, man, listen. I would have if if I wasn't gonna hit him, bro. Throw the mic at him or something. I would have definitely roasted his ass back to his seat. Yeah, you gotta you gotta keep All going. Right, okay. All right, so okay. All right, so that's, so that's okay. So we got CP's take. Okay, uh, Lulu, give us your take, and then after Lulu is Billy. So Lulu, give us your take on this. What's your stance? I already told y'all how I felt. Look, one, if he felt that type of way. As a woman, you got to know when to reel it in. You got to know when to reel your nigga in. And that wasn't the moment. That was the moment she was supposed to grab his arm and be like, uh uh uh, sit your ass down, nigga. We at the Oscars. See? You be the yep. ass at the after party. That's right. Yeah. That's right. That's, That's good, how you right. beat a nigga ass. Don't, I'm not going to ruin my. F- I worked 20 fucking years for this shit. They don't give a fuck no more. They, they don't give a fuck. this shit away for Chris fucking Rock, right. who's probably just doing all this shit now because why? He's going on tour. And don't it look good to come out and say a couple one liners and people be like, that nigga funny again. Let me go, uh, let me go go on tour and watch that nigga. That's how that go. And it, and everybody's like, well, he didn't write it. That wasn't approved. I, I wrote for award shows. That that shit gotta get approved. You can't just go out there and willy nilly that shit. Nah, they probably told that nigga, don't say nothing about Jada. Just focus on. The, the nominee. She wasn't even a fucking nominee. This the Oscars. You talking about Jada Smith, my nigga? Nigga, this fucking Gwyneth Paltrow, my guy. Focus somebody, on that. Like, what are you doing? Right. I feel you, Lulu, because somebody's like, why is uh, why is Will Smith here with Pharrell? And I was like, who? And then it was... But I'm saying, look, I get it. Gonna shoot, huh? But I get it because you know what I'm saying? Like, I hey, Sleepy want to Pharrell with Will Smith so bad. Like, <laughs> yeah, like, you know, <laughs> He was ha- it was his moment, it's his night, and it probably was like all up in his head, like all the shit that everybody been saying. Yeah. People getting on him on the internet, and he's like, Yo, I'm just like I'm tired. He probably was just like, Yo, I'm tired, and that nigga lost it. I just I just said if you was gonna do that shit, do it at the at the party. But your award, you you tarnished it. You you forever tarnished what you accomplished because nobody's thinking about how the great the movie is. Nobody's thinking about how a great actor you are. Everybody's like the smack though. And then now your idol has somehow ruined his image. Like it, it's just weird to me. It's weird. Mm, right. It's weird. All right. Last but not least. Last but not least, Billy, give us your stance on Billy it. Billy, real shit. Uh, I'm divorced, so I, I definitely wouldn't have never smacked Chris Rock after I know what I know now. Because then, what, what if they get divorced? Now you out here single and shit. Now you looking at Chris looking weak than a bitch because you done smacked him over, bitch. They ain't fucking with you no more. So I definitely now know I wouldn't have did that. That shit is over with. You out here at the war, so yeah, this is where this nigga gonna snap me. Now this bitch ain't even with him no more. You looking crazy. And, and and I realized Chris could have said a couple things. He could have said, as soon as he got smacked, he could have said, hey, man, you know, I will hit you back, Will, but I don't hit gay niggas or women. And he could have got <laughs> the roll right there. And, and he, and he could have took the mic and ran and then just being really in his character, man. Like, you know what? If you go hit me over this, I'd have, I'd have, I'd have, bruh. I'd have ran all around this stage. I'd have been everywhere. I would have August Alcina would him to death. August Alcina would have been trending by the time that award show would have been over with. Because... You, you got to just just let it fly. And then that's where you get your infamy from. He had a moment. His moment wasn't just to take a smack. His moment was to just go complete buck wild. Exactly. He could have been like, Jada, 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 He could have said Jada, Jada, Jada. He could have said a couple of things. You know what? Uncle Phil ain't pleased with what you just did. <laughs> right. He, <laughs> he said, and that's why that nigga didn't want you to be his son. Then he left your ass. That's why he left you. Well, that's why he don't want you. Hey, it. Billy. It's it just happened. Many. And I can feel warm, man. I wanted this. It just happened. <laughs> 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 If Chris Rock had to say, how can we smack me, man? <laughs> hey, bro. It's so much he could have did. I mean, the last but sure not least, though, although although we don't think Chris did enough, he did just enough for white folks to oh, feel love. like he's safe, acceptable, they steadfast, and reliable. And he's going to get booked to death. Yeah, they said his ticket sales sales for his tour increased. Listen, bro, because you know who he is? He represents millennials in the space of saying what you want to say, the uncomfortable thing in the room. That's what he gets by just not responding. Also, he realized two things. 
the way Will Smith smacked him, he knew he didn't want to run that fade because had he oh, hell no. it <laughs> on any kind of way, that just would have been you got your ass whooped in front of everybody. Yep. And that's worse. Now, both y'all ain't getting hired back no more. You think they would have let uh, Will rush the stage again by himself? No. No, if if, oh, if, if Chris would have swung back or tried to hit Will back, oh, yeah, they, they would have just fired right? both of them. He, he just right. they, first, right. they would have slipped in them dress shoes, and they Will is real fast. Right. Yeah, now, Will still would have Will would have ran. Will, let's not act like Will didn't train for Ali. Let's, let's get all that nigga is Ali, nigga. Yeah, years ago. Yeah, but he he trained. They look like he trained every day. He was fat for like two days and then wasn't fat no more. I like what the fuck and he did. And you know what Will could have done? Ronda, wait a minute, wait a minute. The sorcery. <laughs> Hey, <laughs> lies, the lies, <laughs> the lies. Hey, man, you know what he could have I have never said nothing. Sorry, go ahead. <laughs> Will Smith could have just not said nothing until it was time to do his speech and then say, Hey man, I want I know there was jokes said about your hair, baby, but I love it. And he would have won yeah. everything. Yeah. Over. Yep. You, yep. you could have waited until it was your time and just said, you know, I know Chris said you look like G.I. Jane, but you a real superhero to And you a real rider for me, baby. And yeah. you didn't, and I wouldn't be this without you. So yeah, you're right, Chris. She yeah. is hard, you know, and then he'd have got Everything he wanted and more, but that's yeah. emotion versus logic. I don't know. He got him back with the speech, though. They was all he, he cried. He gave him some tears. Yeah, and, yeah, but see, he got he got some right people back. Now, he could have got everybody with the speech. True. He, he got some got, of us back. He could have got speech, everybody right. had he not responded. I like right. that. He, I like that stance, below. I like that stance. Yeah, like yeah that that's stance. the way. Man. Coming from a nigga who's been emotional and made poor decisions in his life, I've I've had them. <laughs> no, you been you ain't made no Jeez. poor decisions. <laughs> hey, I'm just saying. Well, you made poor decisions. I mean, you did that, man. First of all, wearing this turtleneck with this jacket, that was the first poor decision I made. <laughs> I didn't know together at all. It was warm as hell on the plane, though. Nigga, hey, got that Carl Thomas chain outside the uh, turtleneck. And I wish I never met her. <laughs> Carl Thomas chain. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, even though it was crazy. Hey, hey, Shout out hey, Carl uh, Thomas, because we, hey, we've been hey, hanging hey, out lately. Hey. Hey, show us the jacket. Stand up. Show us the jacket. Stand up. Show us the jacket. No, my jacket. Hold on, bro. My jacket flushed now. Yeah, this. Hey, this is clean. No, no, CP jacket. I want to see CP jacket. Ah, he didn't ask for Billy's. He asked for CP. Let me see CP jacket. Hold on. It's jacket day. Y'all need this vest? Y'all need this vest, too? Yeah, hey, let's see that. Hey, let's see that vest you got on over there, Ronnie. I know it's the vest to go with that. Uh, oh, big vest, nigga. Oh, big man. vest. Oh, he got the Paisley. That's the uh pa the Paisley uh gang print shit. Okay. okay. You, 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 you can't go on 60 and Chris. Okay. Cozy. Yes, Come on, that's, that's New York. That's, that's New a New York jacket that the girls steal. Like, baby, let me borrow your jacket real quick. I'm going to go to the store. Yep. Never get it back either. Jacket. Never get it back. Y'all. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, they're trying to rust my jacket, man. Hey, once I look it up, uh, Google the jacket, please. Google the jacket. Oh, it's Googleable. It's Googleable. Google my jacket, bitch. Yeah, nigga. Yeah, go on, go on stock X. <laughs> Google my shit. Oh, hey, not the stock. Pop shit, man. Yeah, yeah. Show up. I'm not gonna do that. I'll save it for roast me. You know what I'm saying? B Lil. Okay. What's your opinion on it, B Lil? Let's go ahead and get your oh, opinion. Oh, that, oh, my opinion on it, man. Uh I feel like uh Will stood on principles. At the end of the day, I just I just feel like he stood on principles. It wasn't emotional. Say that. It, it was emotional, but I feel like that nigga stood on principles. You know, sometimes principles are not warranted. From society, as far as you know, as a good thing, but hey, that nigga still on principles. I bet one nobody else joke on that nigga. I bet everybody. <laughs> but look, but well, what does that mean for comedians though? Like, do you think niggas gonna walk up on us and shit like that? Because never. It, it feel like it feel like it's a license to goddamn. You know, you don't get a shot. Fuck with me. I'm gonna tell you what. Georgia's the right to carry state, and I will pop one of y'all niggas. So is Texas. <laughs> no, it's not that. It's not that. It's not that. But see, I grew up in. But see, I mean, a lot of y'all went to the same type of high school, and I was roasting. But you know, certain niggas that'll try you, and you gotta be prepared. Like if you roast a nigga, and he be like, "Hey, nigga, I beat your ass." You gotta either be like, "Okay, I'm sorry, be a pussy," or you be like, "Nigga, we can fight the squad." You know what I'm saying? We can. You get gotta keep roasting. What was the first thing you said? What was the first thing you said, Bilu? Uh -huh. I think say what? In high school, I'm saying you said or say I'm sorry. No, I'm saying you can either say I'm sorry or shoot the oh. fair one. Yeah, I personally like I like niggas going. Has, back to has anybody got to fight on stage before? Anybody ever try to get anybody ever try to fight y'all for roasting them? I got video of it. Anybody <laughs> never tried me? I had a drug dealer try to kill me before. Not gonna win. Anybody never tried me, but me I and Sco Bubba got into it one time in Uptown. I didn't, you know, I didn't recognize Sco Bubba at first. Sco Bubba got all got got the roasting and yelling out the crowd while I was up there. So I'm going back and forth. And he was like, nigga, fuck you, nigga. 
And then he stood up and walked to the store. And they were like, nigga, let's go, Bubba. I was like, oh, my bad, Scope Bubba. Thought you was somebody else. Yeah, he I'm was like, like a you, better, never, rest in peace, Scope Bubba. Scope Bubba, the legend, bro. Yeah, shout out to Scope Bubba. I, I, I never roast on stage no more because the shit too much, bro. I'm too powerful with that shit, man. Like, they, they just regular people, man. They didn't sign up for that. You know what I'm saying? I just, True. I used to come out like when, when I was a brand new comedian, I used to want to roast because I was scared to bomb. So I go out there and just take it out on them. Look at this motherfucker right here with the, uh, bam. And then, you know, get a couple giggles. And you know me, nigga. I'm like a juggernaut. A couple laugh. Next thing you know, nigga, I didn't got all the momentum. And it's, you know, and it's like, man, I didn't, I didn't really, I didn't have motherfuckers ready to kill me, dog. Straight up, like nigga, I'll catch you outside. I'm like, ooh, if it's every time I'm finna run the light. Yeah, I've had that happen a couple times. You know the drunk, the Atlanta dope boys be like, I'm gonna kill your fat ass boy. I'm like, well, I better keep roasting it, cause fuck you, nigga. <laughs> yeah, bro. Nigga, you can't right, shoot. Man. Hey, Billy, Billy, hey, Billy, what time is it, Billy? Hey, Billy, what time is it? <laughs> it's time to switch topics. Hey, hey. All right, here we go. We're gonna, up, up, we're gonna finish up, with this. We're up. gonna finish with this one, man. Uh, how do y'all feel about the good old Biden trying to? I believe it's it's twenty percent of a hundred million a hundred million dollar households now. Time to tax them. Time to tax uh, oh, yeah. 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 so many more black billionaires now. They looking. Like, we got to tax these. But with, back when there was Warren Buffett and the motherfuckers like that, you ain't hear shit like this <laughs> at all. Yeah, true. Fuck this old uh, skeleton with a jacket on. <laughs> soon as soon as Ernie Leisure came out, them niggas start making new bills and shit. Like soon as Kanye got six point six billion, it ain't like that. Mm. True. Mm. Y'all, y'all think y'all think Kanye gonna slap Pete? Yeah. No. No, cause somebody gonna sue Kanye. He ain't like Will Smith. Somebody gonna yeah. sue that nigga. You don't you don't slap a nigga taller than you. You, you got a soccer tall nigga. You don't slap no tall nigga. And you can't slap a dude that's with your wife because he's going to go back over there. See what you got to do to a tall nigga? <laughs> Punch that neck. <laughs> <laughs> Punch that neck. Nigga, what the, what the little nigga on? What the little nigga on? <laughs> I'm looking at this budget, man. They ain't even put nothing on here for more parking spaces downtown in LA, man. Hey, y'all need to get some more parking, man. Fuck, fuck getting law enforcement. Get 30 billion parking. to support law enforcement. Shut your ass over that old ass material. Y'all need to be hey, parking downtown. Anybody got to park down here? <laughs> hey, man. Hey, this shit this? ain't changed. This shit ain't changed. Did I say this? Ain't no space. Ain't no space. Ain't, 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 ain't no parking. Goddamn Ubers at seventy five dollars. Ladies, 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 make some noise if you uh if you walk him in here tonight with somebody that you love. <laughs> you know that? Ladies, make somebody, some noise. Somebody you laughing voice. right? Is somebody laughing right now with their car? Ain't gonna never get it out. Ladies, make some noise if you feel good tonight. <laughs> <laughs> It's the feel. It's the feel good. I wasn't gonna laugh. You said the feel good tonight. If you feel good tonight, that's real good hey, tonight. Hey, 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 CP, what about the comic who always think you stealing his shit? Nigga, be like, he stole that from me. What's just? Hey, 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 how y'all doing? You like? Real quick, real quick, brother. Hey, hey, no, no disrespect. I got a joke about the ABCs. <laughs> and you hey. use a lot of letters in your joke. Hold on, listen, 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 listen. Okay, now. Listen. <laughs> Now, my joke go to the tune of why is it that ain't no black alphabet, right? Yo shit kind of like, nigga, hey. fuck out my face, nigga. <laughs> hey, CP, what about, the, what about the dude that tell everybody in the audience who joke you doing? Now you doing Daryl Damn tonight. I guess it's what he's doing here tonight, huh? You gonna do Nard, huh? That's what boy's doing. That's Daryl Shane. They gotta come you see the nigga up here? Hey, you see the nigga up here? <laughs> wow. Hey, oh, I see boys doing K Dub old shit in here tonight. Huh? That's what they doing. Well, they, they, boy, these niggas doing old just knees jokes in this whole life. <laughs> All right, real Bro, quick, man. man. We're going to go in the comment section, man. While we at it, man, before we get out there, we're going to go in the comment section and see what they got to say. Josh Amara says, I ain't vote. Oh, no, that's not the homie. Oh, Lulu. Somebody Lulu got looks like a Somebody else got to read him. This nigga said, hey, you. Hey, thank you. Hey, thank you. Smiley what? face, smiley face. He does look like a background dancer from West Side Story. That ain't, that ain't that bad. I, I got you. To get it out, man. Thank hey, you. I got you. Yeah, from West Side Story. I mean, it, I, I, I see it. Actually. I can see it. I see it. Actually, go ahead, go ahead, Dean. Take over. Take over the comments for me, Dean, because they're coming kind of fast, man. Go ahead. All right. 
I was in the theater production of West Side Story, bitch. Damn. Okay. They said you read it. They said they read you. They said you read the comments like you were held at gunpoint. Uh, You're all cheaters. <laughs> and that was funny. Whoever said that, that was funny. Uh, yeah, peep this shit. You're all cheaters. It's a it's a it's a, a mock hoodie. So you just throw the hoodie on. You know what I'm saying? They got like a little uh, a little scarf, little mask and shit. This shit lit, bro. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah, I would never get that. I would never pick that. I would never pick that. Nigga, I mean, nigga, I see. You got, yeah, you got that guy never... hat on. You're in front of a brick wall. Nigga, shut up. Nigga, you in an alley right now. <laughs> What's topic? <laughs> What's topic? <laughs> What's topic? Next up, we're doing that. Hold on, we're going back in it. There we go, Bila. There we go, Bila. <laughs> hey, Bila, you caught you clutch your pearls, Bila. I'm telling y'all right now, man. It feel real. It feel real good out here, man. Thank you. Thank you. Oh shit. Oh shit. On the side of the Penobscot building. All right, come on. Man. He said B Lou outside of Applebee's. Yeah, that was man, y'all are <laughs> going crazy to come. Hey, he got that hey, two for two. He got that two for two. Smell these steaks. I smell, boy. <laughs> If they can do what? If they can do what? If y'all can smell these steaks, I'm smelling right now. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> man, they cooking it up in there, man. Oh, oh man. shit. Where Ronnie go? Ronnie was just in his old looking yeah. like a uh, Pee Wee football coach in this bitch. Ronnie, hey, 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 Ronnie, Ronnie laptop fell into his We got the money for stomach. the helmets this year, so I guess we're going <laughs> to. What? Ronnie laptop fell into his stomach. Ronnie laptop fell in his belly button. He tried to get it out. Right now. <laughs> hey. <laughs> <laughs> Telling his belly button is that what you said? That's stupid. <laughs> oh man. CP is not doing those. I can't front. Oh. <laughs> Look, he go to U-Burst Remote Bay. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> Let's even get him back. He's still loading up on that side. But, I mean, that's all. Look like you about to teach everybody how to manifest, and this is how you manifest your goals. Write it down. I do. I got, I got a manifesting board in my room. You want one? I make you them. Good. You know us black women got to stick together. Yes. <laughs> Let's see. Let's see if he's there. Nah, we just got number the Yeah, Ronnie right there. Yeah, well, 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 anyway, man, Ronnie did his part, man. But we're about to conclude another episode of Roast hey. This before hey, we get out of here, man. We always. What you say, Dean? It's like Ryan. I'm sorry. Go ahead. My bad. Somebody asked me to say it. I swear to God. Go ahead. <laughs> All right, man. But last but not least, you know, before we get out of here, man, we always tell the people what we got going on and what we're doing for the following week. So, starting with Billow, let the people know, man, where they can find you, what you got going on. Tomorrow, if you've not done so already, get ready to get on caffeine because I'm flying over your traffic update tomorrow in Roast Me, <laughs> season five, all the way there. Um, make sure you check it out. Um, my single and my first EP will be available on Thursday. All available in a new episode of Did You Miss Me podcast this Thursday. It's a fun week. Tomorrow, caffeine. Wednesday, take a break. And Thursday, Did You Miss Me podcast. And check out the Bill O EP. All available EP. on iTunes, okay. wherever music is found. All right. The EP. Lulu Gonzalez. That's the Lulu. Lulu. Um, y'all can follow me here on Caffeine. I will be back streaming, playing Call of Duty, 2K, and Justice 2, all the good shit over there. Um, stand up wise, if you're in Virginia, June 7th and 8th, I'll be in Richmond and Virginia Beach at the Funny Bone. And this hey, weekend, up. and this weekend, uh, and I'll be in San Diego Laugh Factory and Laugh Factory Hollywood. Hey, CP, let the people know, man. Uh, shit, what up, though? If y'all in New York, man, I'm doing some dates at the stand. I'm finna post it on my face. You know, any, anytime I'm in New York, I'm always at the stand. Uh, so on 116, so I'm um, doing that. Uh, can't wait to get back to get on roast me, man. You know, I'm actually in New York filming right now. So, um, you know, yeah, that's it, man. Follow me at Comedian CP. Y'all follow me on here. I don't know why my cash, I don't know how to change that. But, um, yeah, man, y'all follow me on Caffeine. Uh, I, I be I be on um, Lulu. You be um, how you get this on your PlayStation to to do this on caffeine? All I got to switch. Like, it's pretty much OBS. Same exact setup. You, you yeah, that OBS. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got to be turning off an actual uh, PC. Uh, oh yeah. Hey Lulu, you got a PS Five? I got a PS Four. You got a PS Five plug? Yeah, I got a PS Five. Yeah, I, I do got a plug on it. I got you. Oh, 
Uh, Ronnie go. Jordan, man, let the people Ronnie. know. Man. Let people know where you can find out what you got going on, man. Hey, man, y'all can find me on the Morty Culture Podcast. Y'all, y'all check us out, man. We got a bunch of nice new guests coming up. We had Lulu Gonzalez on there recently. Um, I'll go to Ronnie Jordan on YouTube, uh, officialblessedaf.com. Saturday, I'm going to be at uh, in St. Paul, Minnesota at NACA, Northeast NACA Live. I'm going to be hosting. Um, and also next week on April 6th, I will be at NC State with my boy Beat Out and my boy Chindadu. Um, also, uh, April 7th is my birthday, goddammit. The real nigga who was born yeah, last yeah. next week, you know what I'm saying? Niggas are turning a couple hundred pounds and goddamn, you know what I mean? <laughs> appreciate y'all. It's happening. Appreciate all death, man. Y'all, this year, y'all been fucking with me this year. I really appreciate y'all. This shit been dope. What's up, what's up? Hey, hey real man, talk. I'm your host. Yeah, I'm about to say, yeah, start getting some lettuce and some tomatoes and some hamburgers, bro. I, be, I did, I did today. I, I, was, I was gonna hit you. I was gonna hit you. I tell you, it feel like a little salad. <laughs> no, it feel like a little pita. Look, they had the baby. They had the baby tomatoes too. Do the pickles? Do the lettuce? Do the onions? And it, and it hit like a little a Caesar salad sandwich. We talk. We talk. We gonna talk. We gonna talk. We gonna talk. Last but not least, man, I'm your host Brandon Lewis, man. You can find me on platform Instagram at Who Is Brandon Lewis, man. Tomorrow, caffeine. That's right. Season five of Roast Me, the classroom edition, drops. So make sure you guys tune in, man. I am your host of that wonderful funny show and i will be in orlando florida so if you're in orlando florida this weekend man anybody that's watching the show right now that will be watching if you're in orlando this weekend i got five shows with tony baker i'm the host with the most this whole weekend in orlando man so pull up on us buy some merch show some love uh make sure you download the app caffeine get ready for season five roast me tomorrow i'm brandon lewis that's comedian cp that's ronnie jordan that's billy sorrell aka billo and that's the lovely beautiful lulu gonzalez and we are out yes sir my thoughts about the video i really enjoyed it cp is really really funny billo billy He's okay. He's okay. He had his moments and everything. Ronnie Jordan, I don't like his jokes like that because every time CP has something to say about him, he always tag along. He doesn't have a rebuttal to say. But um, other than that, the podcast was good. I really enjoyed their feedback on the Will Smith situation. You know, ever since that situation happened, Everybody and their grandma talk about that situation, and I don't want to talk about it again. So I'm glad it's over. It's been a few months now. It's been a few weeks, actually. So, um, yeah. Thank you guys for watching. I will be posting the new episode of Roast Me Season 5, Episode 5, today, which will be tonight. When they upload it, I will post it to my channel. Like I said in my previous videos, I actually decided to re-upload videos because I wanted no problems with monetization when that time come. When I do feel comfortable with applying for monetization, it should go smoothly as possible. But thank you. Until next time, peace.